Welcome everybody to uh, Zoeti, the same tri simply trial with the Valentina on normal difficulty. So let me just start the game right away. And we're going to story mode and Valentina. And it time starts as soon as I click start game. Tech, I will might will be resetting a few times because I need a certain skill at the beginning. You can just let the timer run. It, it's fine. Estimate is accounted for that I do that. Uh, so without any further ado, in a three, two, one, let's go. All right, so this one, we pick an uh, upgrade, then we get a skill, which I don't care about. And then I hope I get the skill I don't, so I will go to the main menu to do this again. I hope RNG is a bit with me to give me this quickly. If we reset, it takes around, I don't know, 30 seconds. Uh, I don't want it on a mini flush because the mini flush is the skill I need. And of course, uh, RNG is already doing its job perfectly fine by not giving me the skill I want. So hang on tight before we really hop into this perfect game. Um, nope. Wow, uh, love RNG. Anyway, uh, double while I'm trying to find my skill, uh, do you have something to say? Um, I certainly do, because we are the Benelux Peterna Gathering. Uh, a dedicated organization focused on hosting marathons within the Benelux region. Currently, we are excited to be live streaming our annual event from Hotel Asteria in Venray, the Netherlands. Uh, we are raising money for MIND, which is a nationwide organization committed to prevent mental health issues. MIND strives to provide support to individuals and families facing mental health challenges. All of your donations will go to MIND. I don't mind that. Anyway, I got a skill finally, so we can play the game now. Um, so, uh, what skill did I get? I got a skill that uh, when my... Uh, I will do a certain amount of damage equal to my armor class. And uh, it starts at level 1 and it will do 80%. Then it will go to... Uh, uh, let me quickly select some stuff. Uh, then it will go to 100% in level 2 and then on 120% in level 3. Or at least that is what it should do. However, that's not what it does. And then you're asking, Clover, what does it do? Well, at level 1, it actually does zero damage. Yeah, it's very fortunate. Um, at, at level 2, it will do around 100% damage. Uh, at level 3 is where the fun really begins. So, um, yeah. Let me just quickly not die on this first boss, at least. Uh... This temporary. Uh, I might not be temporary. Oh, this might be a problem. Oh, it is temporary, okay. So yeah, just, uh, the, since we cannot do our cool technique yet, I have to just now try to defeat him the normal way. Uh, oh, there you go. Is he gonna run in seconds? No, not, not. Uh, I will quickly give myself some armor. Great, straight. I think I'm getting now. All right, there we go. That's uh, first, first of the three done. Uh, ooh, ooh, how's that? Give me that one. All right, lovely. So that's the first of the six chapters or story arcs done. Uh, this game has like three scenes. Uh, we're playing only scene one here. Uh, let me rest. Let me meditate. So let me go to here and upgrade it. I need a certain amount of crystals. I will need eight crystals to upgrade it in the second time. So we need, still need six more. And now we're gonna get a few items. Those are uh, the item is random. We always get an herb. That's guaranteed. And then technically we could talk, get some dialogue, some interesting game. Uh, we can go to the shop, but we don't need that. 
so we're just gonna continue uh, go into mission stage two and uh i can see there is a little bit of a fortunate path but i don't sure if i'm gonna take it and this bee is annoying because it will keep put it on force fields uh so i'm just gonna try to um signal pin it Almost, almost. Okay, so it's not that bad. Okay, so I have five. I need three more. So I would, I think, need would need to win one more fight. I'm not sure if I can do that. Let me check the map really quick. Uh, I could go here. You know what? I will do that. Normally, I would not go for it, but I do want that upgrade actually. So um, I'm gonna put this straight on you. Oh, that is the random thing. So let me quickly uh, heal. <laughs> so there you go. Uh, can I at least kill this thing? No, I'm dealing two damage. I will keep it my keep my hands. At least for the guarantee, I guess. Of course. Uh, I can kill this one. I think I can kill all of them. Yeah. Oh, nice. Nice, 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 nice. And we got three, so we are exactly at the right amount of skills, uh, amount of crystals. So we should be good. And then we can make the fun begin. So I'm going to go here. This will be an event which we don't have to do anything. Don't purchase. Yes, don't purchase. All right. So then we go to the camp. Uh, then I'm gonna meditate, crash my game, of course. I'm gonna return really quick uh, and then continue the game. This has happened before. Uh, we were running on an earlier patch, uh, so uh, not everything being that stable sometimes makes sense. Uh, so mini flash. I want to upgrade it to level three. Yes. Then I want to go back. I want to quickly set. Uh, for the, this one, I want to set the attack, and for the signal, I want to set my shield. And I'm gonna rest because that's obligated. And then we should be good to go to have the god combo. All right. So now the speedrun really starts since uh, we're gonna have interesting fights. You see this boss? It has a lot of health. I'm gonna put it on flush. Okay. So we see here, and we have on flush. So six times 120% is. Can somebody do the math? Did you say 72? Yeah, you were correct. And I don't do my math correctly. So, uh, yay. <laughs> anyway, yes, this... Uh, there is a bug uh, in the early versions where uh, damage is not uh, calculated correctly for this skill. And instead of it uh, doing the percentages, does at level 3, it does 12 times our damage, uh, our, our armor class as damage. And uh, yeah, we're gonna abuse that a lot. So now I'm gonna quickly focus and uh, at the meantime, uh, double. Um, this game is terrific. Can uh, the people at home maybe um, do something with that? Uh, indeed, they can. Uh, in fact, I did mention it earlier, but I'll, uh, I'll reiterate it for anyone that may have tuned in later. And um, yeah. So at the, as you can uh, as you can see on screen right now is the roguelite about player choice uh, about uh, develop no it's a, it is a turn-based roguelite developed by uh, developed by Dustlight and published by Akapara Games. It features a deck of playing cards used to create card combos and activate skills in the heat of battle. Bolster your arsenal of skills and overcome the evil plaguing your land. Check out Zoeti now on Steam. And just so you know, if you donate a minimum of ten euros, you are eligible to win a copy of the game. I can really recommend it, and uh, I know I have a few keys, and I would love to uh, see more runners of this game. I'm currently the only runner, but it's a little bit lonely on my leaderboard. But uh, ah, it can happen. How does that? How did the path look? Oh, that looked horrible. Uh, one, two, three. Um. So I also want to keep my card management because I want to make sure that I can like actually destroy them really quick. 
Uh, so I'll do this. Um, that's not enough. It's fine. I'm gonna attack like that. End my turn. When I save the cards to defeat him. Uh, one, two, three. Mini flush. Terrific. All right, uh, and we're already in stage three as well, so this is going all perfectly fine. Uh, let me quick look at the time. Oh, no biggie. Okay, so this is the quickest pass because that's two events, so uh, we will just go for that. Escape. Bye. We're not gonna battle. Battling is slow. We don't want that. So that's that's a bit of a uh, yeah. Like um, I think most people uh, who play roguelites, for example, have played. Uh, Slate Aspire with branching and such, and it kind of looks like that. Alright, um, I want this one, this one, and, um, uh, no, actually, I'm gonna play it safe, I'm gonna just destroy him. I hope I roll a draw flush. I don't. Uh, it's fine. I'm gonna draw flush anyway in the next hand. I can see the next three cards I draw. Those are flush potential, so I'm making sure I overkill. Not needed, but it's fine. Um, so, yeah, uh, we're smoothing through the game. Um, here, I just select something for free. I don't even have to do a battle, if I remember correctly. No, I never mind. I'm misremembering. Never mind. Uh, I'm gonna do a full house, and then it's just gonna attack me. Don't do any damage, and I will keep 60% of my armor. Uh, I didn't do much that much, but yeah. So look, it's a big boss, 180 health. Um, bye. So yeah, of course, later on they fixed this because um, in normal clear playthrough, this is not really fun. Uh, cheesing on the bosses. Not really enjoying the game as it's supposed to be. Um, but yeah, as a speedrunner, I kind of like that. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, I down patched the game. Uh, I made a guide on it. If you're thinking like, hey, this looks interesting. I'm, I'm a fan of roguelikes. Um, give it a shot. Or you're like, ooh, that's a bit expensive. Donate a bit. And indeed, maybe you're one of the few lucky people who actually wins in... Uh, a game key of this game. I, I can say I really, really recommend it. And even I haven't done everything in this game yet because there are also uh, other characters. Uh, I have not even touched them yet. And uh, their deck uh, arrangement is different as well as their skills. So it's like a lot of variety. Uh, and of course, there are multiple scenes. Um, and the story is also very intriguing. I will not go into the story uh, here. Uh, because I just want to be... Oh, that's a good path. That's a good path. Good path. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, I'm just gonna focus on that. That one runs away. The last one runs away anyway. In a few turns. And I figured this one was gonna do uh, damage. One, two, three. Should be enough. Yay, there we go. Right. So, um, for, for me, it's like early in the morning. Uh, so how are you doing, chat? I hope you had a good night's sleep or you're about to go to sleep. And you hope I hope you're enjoying the marathon so far. I'm at least uh, I'm, on, I'm enjoying it as well. It was a little bit of scary waking up and then realizing, oh, we are a lot ahead of schedule, which means that we had some amazing progression with the runners, which is, I would say, pretty cool. Uh, and I'm gonna probably add to that. I was like, why is my game freezing? But it's all right, uh, battle. Ah, oh, look at that big guy. Looks like he's gonna do something. Uh, no, actually, one more. Select him, and... Ooh, he's actually gotta do something. I didn't have enough to kill him. Ow. 
Goodbye. Uh, I think I'm just gonna put up a shield and just draw. I see two hearts, so I should be good with a flush right now. I hope I get two, actually. Uh, I do. Amazing. So that is stage four done. And we have six stages in this first uh, scene. And I'm, uh, as you could see, after level 3, I stopped upgrading my uh, Rogan skill, as I like to call it. And I have been upgrading my uh, level 1. Oh, I'm upgrading the one pair. Oh, that's why I'm not dealing on lots of damage. One second. Uh, return to my menu. I was already like, well, I'm not dealing a lot of damage. I should be, but I've been upgrading the wrong skill. <laughs> Terrific. Let me quickly fix that. Uh, so I was supposed to upgrade the... Uh, how is it called? The signal. But I've been upgrading the level 1 pair. So actually what I'm going to do as well... No, it's going to be complicated. I, I'm going to leave it like that. <sighs> yeah, that sometimes happens when you're... Uh, Still a little bit in the ruse of waking up. I, I'm gonna blame it on that, you know. Uh, I can use a path here. This one looks more fortunate. Hmm. Um. Right. One, two. Uh, flush on that one. These creatures are annoying. But it seems like I can maybe get away with it. Uh, uh. Oh, I actually can. Oh, that's amazing. Bye. Oh, and it just gives me the shield level up for level for levels one for for the single one. Oh, that's amazing! Thank you, RNG. All right, um, one, two. I love to see that. Uh, so yeah, now we can click through the top layer. Praying bit. But we don't care about praying. Uh, give, give me two give me two normal items. I'm okay with that. So yeah, normally we, we have a lot of items as well. We have a lot of uh, passive items or skills. Uh, you could also technically upgrade your passive skills. I'm all not doing that. It's like I, I believe in this broken combination so that's why i'm uh so yeah that's time go for the balls of uh chapter three uh i don't care uh no i don't want my hands vegan so i'm just gonna put the easy one all right uh one two three uh you i guess Does it keep doing this? Uh, one, two, three. I'm not sure what's gonna happen actually, so I'm just hoping that this one kill. Okay, it does. I might, I might need to skip it one turn. Yeah, I need to skip a turn. So the next turn, I do have enough. Making sure. All right. Yes, that's more than enough. All right. So that was the boss of chapter. Five. Uh, the bosses are random, by the way. If anyone's asking, um, 
you have so many bosses there are also different achievements to bosses in later chapters uh, you have different characters the ending is different you get a reward for the whole ending story uh, if you do it alone or you do it with somebody else it's 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 a cool game i love it i love it a lot um you know what actually let me just for the fun of it upgrade this one as well And before it's not doing it should it should be good and before i just screwed over my uh, last part of the run but, uh, i should not have done that if i'm right because the this the last one the 140 percent also has the bug that it will do 12 or 14 percent uh, for 12 or 14 damage okay this looks like an, a relatively fortunate path uh one two as you can see there. Oh, those are actually the only cards I didn't need to throw away, but I, well, I'm getting the correct cards now anyway. So one, oh, oh, one, two, three. Look at that damage output, ladies and gentlemen. You'll love to see that. I did not have a mini flush here. Wow, that's that's something. Look at that armor though. Look at that armor though. It would be a shame if we just waltz through that, right? Yeah, that's a shame. I hope I can rest still, but I don't think I need it. But uh, wait, was this the pad I should have taken? Let me look back, actually. Oh, it didn't, it didn't matter. It didn't matter. Okay. I would have to fight an enemy anyway. Might have mattered. Uh, but not for the reasons uh, that it... All right. Anyway. Okay, I hope your shield is gone. Uh, it's not yet. I'm on any flesh on you. So now what I want to do is I want to do one pair. Yeah, that's fine. And then I can do mini flush. Scale lane. Amazing. The shield is annoying. Uh, th th those, the enemies with the shield slow me down the most in this run. Uh, so just not taking any risk of not being on full health. We should be fine, but not taking any chances here. So yeah, final boss. Uh, time is not ending on final boss, but it ends on... Uh, oh, okay. It ends on um, seeing the, the final uh, result screen. I will say when it ends. Oh, it survived that. Oh, interesting. So first, get the big guy out of the way. Would be terrific if I draw and flush. Of course not. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so this is what max damage does. Bam. Alright, so the time is coming up relatively soon. Uh, so get ready on the timer. And... Time. Oh, I see 
24 minutes and 4 seconds. I know that I was busy with the first 2-3 minutes with resetting. So that need not a PB, but I'm saying pretty happy with this. Um, I want to thank uh, Acapura Games and uh, all the others uh, for uh, one, giving uh, me this game uh, when they were releasing it uh, to give me an opportunity to learn the game, like play the game, love the game and also for providing us with some uh steam keys and some switch keys it's like thank you guys so much uh i want to thank bsg for having me here i will be back tomorrow with warioware uh, against boxmeister that's gonna be a lot of fun a lot of memes you need to be there um anyway i'm gonna give it back to the host double double take it away all right thank you clover uh for this showcase of zoeti uh as we mentioned before, you can uh, you can donate to uh, enter in for a prize to win this game. And uh, I may have something else uh, that you could also be happy about. Because uh, I have a three euro donation here from Satanic Nerd. Saying, hey Clover, I see I have 5,000 characters for a comment here, Kappa. What math do you want me to explain? Enjoying your run and this game looks interesting. Thank you, Satanic Nerd, for the uh, for the three euros and your comment. Yeah, I I said it like I said that he couldn't be here. I was like, I want the math teacher to explain how math works because the math ain't nothing in this game. But sadly couldn't be bad. I appreciate the donation nonetheless. Thank you, Satanic. All right, and with that, we're gonna be hopping back to intermission to get our next run set up, which will be Peggle Deluxe by Brassbeat. So stay tuned. <laughs> 